Welcome to another edition of Inside the Film Room as we look back at the Giants' win against the Cincinnati Bengals. Bob Pop with two-time Super Bowl champion David Deal. And David, we're going to break down the play on the third and six late in the ballgame as the Giants are trying to run the game out. They get a clutch first down and a nine-yard run by Rashad Jennings. Huge run by Jennings, but this is what you have to love about Eli Manning as a quarterback. You see the two linebackers, Dansby and Perfect, mugged up inside those A-gaps over Weston Richburg. But he understands what they're going to do because of where the tight end is lined up and where they need Carlos Dansby to be in coverage considering the fact it is a third and six. He checks and alerts out of the play. He sees it right now. You see him come up to the line of scrimmage and put the offense into a different play. That is what allows them to run this play and move Jennings to that side. If he does not check out of this play, they are completely out leveraged because the tackle, the tight end, and the guard would never be able to cut off and get inside to Dansby. And that's what opens things up for them. You see Eli Manning walk up, check to the play. You're going to see a double team, which is the key double team. Left guard, center from Marshall Newhouse to Richburg to the second level. You see the easy backside leverage. It took easy. Bobby Hart really didn't even have to put his hand on a three technique because of how far Dansby moved outside. So that's why the Giants were able to get that critical play, get the first down, and run their offense and eventually get to the victory formation. Great breakdown as always. Thank you. Two-time Super Bowl champion David Deal. I'm Bob Papa. Thanks for joining us inside the film room.